of really smoothened out rocks. And they're not all the same thing either. They're all kinds of different rocks. And the reason for that, oh, this one's actually a crab. This is a, this is, this is, this one's a special rock because it's a, because it's a crab shell. But there's all kinds of different rocks here and that's because they all just came from somewhere else. Just like the United States is a big melting pot of different cultures, the North Shore of Long Island is a melting pot of different rocks. Where did they come from? Oh, I'll tell you. Up over there. All the way over there. Over there is Connecticut. The fun thing about this area of Long Island is that this is the northernmost tip. This is the end of Long Island. It's way out way out there. Um, eventually you're going to hit Europe, I think. Uh, this is the furthest east point of the North Fork, because Long Island is split into two forks. We're right here. Down here is Montauk. We're in Orient. And um, the difference between Montauk and Orient is that Montauk has nice beaches where you can play in the sand and build sandcastles. Here is where the geologists go to have fun. And if you go to lie down when you want to have a really bad back in three hours. So what's so cool about this place? What's so cool about Long Island in general? Why are all these fucking rocks here? And why are they all different kinds? If you're from pretty much any other place in the United States, you probably have what's called bedrock, which is layers of rock that have just been there for a really long time and it's underneath all the dirt and stuff that you live on top of. Long Island doesn't have any of that. Long Island is entirely sand, dirt, and rocks. Long Island was formed about uh, 15,000 years ago by a glacier that advanced from the north, dragged all of this stuff with it, picked up all this stuff, picked up huge, huge rocks, 20 times the size of these. If I can pan over in a second, I'll show you what an erratic looks like. Way out there, um, that's, that's a glacial erratic. That's just like a rock that a glacier just dropped. And you can see it's huge.
somewhere else, and then you can skip rocks there and have a darn good time. This is a perfect skipping rock. Look at this. This is perfect. I love it. Okay. Give it a shot. I also should mention that I can't skip rocks. So you're probably wondering what kinds of rocks are here. Short answer, it's a fuckload of quartzite, and it's the least exciting rock, in my opinion. It is my least favorite rock. 